everyone, it's Zoe and today I'm doing another video and today I'm going to be doing a what's in my school bag 2019 and let me tell you moving from primary school to secondary school is a massive massive change because I used to never carry that much stuff in my bag and now I've found that pretty much everything I own for school is in my bag and my bag is so heavy but, I mean, if I don't take it, I will be in trouble. So, let's get into it. This is my school bag, and it's from Primark. I believe this was, like, £12 or £11, something like that. So, it was really cheap, but it's actually really good quality. And it's, like, a leathery material, but it's not real leather. But it's, like, leather. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. And it's got chains as the straps as then this like black things so it doesn't hurt your shoulders too much and then also it's got this weird thing on it i call it an octopus because it's got loads of legs but it's not really called that and it's got like this gold circle thing on it and it's this is like it looks like snakeskin almost on the front but it's like a big snakeskin pat pattern but on the back it hasn't got that so it's just plain but yeah, let's get straight into it and I'm going to put it down because it's really heavy. So first of all, in my bag, when you unzip it, I'll try and show you. Let's see if I can do this. This is what it looks like. It is stuffed to the brim. So in there is two sides pockets. One is smaller than the other. And in the small one, I have change. And I just have two pounds worth of change because if you forget something at school... Or, like, you have to buy lunch and you forgot your dinner money. This is perfect. And also, if you forget something, you can buy stuff at our um, student services. Where, like, you can get a pen, you can get a pencil case, anything, really. And, so, yeah. I just have money in case I do. Or one of my friends does. At least I can help them out. Then, in the bigger pocket, which is next to the little pocket, I have this hand sanitizer. And you can clip this onto your bag, but I find that someone can easily take this, and our school is not, like, anyone will take it, so I prefer just to put it in my little pocket. And this is the Winter Snow Scented Antibacterial Hand Sanitizer, and it's by Simple Pleasures. So that's what it looks like. Then also I have a Nivea Soft Rose Lip Balm, and it's got a tint colour to it, which is really nice, just in case, like, do you want to put some colour on your lips? And then in the zipper pocket, I have some womanly stuff and also some headphones. And I've paper clip, no, this is not a paper clip, it's called a board dog clip. But I've put a clip over it so they don't get all tangled because sometimes in class we're allowed to listen to music, which is really nice. And I don't want to be sat there for like 10 minutes trying to untangle my headphones. So I just have them like this, and these are pink ones i don't know where they're from actually i think my sister got them for me but they're just normal headphones and yes yeah, so that's all for that pocket then in the other pockets i have a my girls fiber kit and i normally sometimes i put this in my locker but other times i just keep it in my bag because if i our lockers we you have to pay for them and i've bought one because i don't want to carry my pee kit around all day and let it stink in my bag so I put it in my locker and it's so much easier than having to carry it around. Like, I don't know what I would have done if I had to carry it around because it's so heavy. Because we have to have, like, football studs, normal trainers, hoodies, like, all the pee stuff. So, yeah, so my locker comes in really handy. But, so this is what I normally, this is my girl survival kit and I just have a video on this and it's uploaded. And this just white bag and it's got everything you ever needed and if you want to know what's actually in it you can go and check my video out so yes this is what's in it you can hear it rattling inside which is really annoying when you walk then i have the book that i'm reading at the moment and it, i just choose these books because like i'm not being funny or anything but look how short it is like it looks really thick on camera but when you read it the pages are like it's really easy to read and I'm already like halfway through it almost to the end and I only started this like a week ago so it's really good just to be able to read it easily and it's quite a good book to be honest I thought it'd be boring but it's quite good 
Then I have this fence case. This is from Wilco. I believe it was two pound. It's got a little gold zipper on it, and like I don't know if you can see, but it's like a weird pattern. It's like chevron and different kind of patterns. And in here, I have my calculator. This is a scientific one, and I actually coloured it in in maths because I was bored. There was nothing to do in maths, and I'm so bored. And I actually put on my details just in case I lose it. And I can't show you what class I'm in or who my teacher is because you'll be able to find me pretty easily. Why am I shutting it? But yeah, this is just a scientific calculator and it's really good for maths because it's got like all these weird buttons on. I don't even know how to use half of them so I don't know why I have it but still. Then I have also in here all different kinds of pens. I have the, I don't know what it's called, Paper Mate Ink Joy pens and these are the mini ones. They're like so much like tinier than the big ones. Then I have the Bic Kids Colour pens, and these are from France, I was like, wow. And then I also have the Stadler, I think I'm pronouncing that right, and it's erasable pencils, and they are so good, like, they're just amazing. But I have all those kinds of pens in here. So if you need a pen, hit me up, because I got them. Then I have my actual pets case now this is just a black pets case because it's just easier and uh where's this from this is from asda i believe it was two pounds as well so it was really good like a good deal and it's like a weird material i can't really explain it but it's got three pockets in so it has like a middle pocket and then two outside pockets and i'll show you what's in these so in the first outside pocket, I have all my pens, pencils, and a ruler. This ruler, I'll put these pens there. This ruler is a helix snap of a one. And this is so much easier than having a long like ruler that is like that. Or one that's just that size, so it's just that. Because that, just having that size, you have to move it across the page if you need to draw something. I'm like, I can't be doing that. But then having a long one that won't fold, you can't really put it in your pencil case because it ends up being stuck out. So I got this snappable one and it's in a purpley colour. And I thought it was really cute. So I just got it for that reason. Self explanatory. Then I have a pencil and it has like this grippy thing on it so it doesn't hurt my fingers. And a cap eraser because I've already used the rubber on the top so I just put a rubber on it so it's easier and these pencils are from the work and the work the works premium it's called and it's um i think there's like 10 in a pack for a pound and they're really good pencils so i was happy with that then i have these two like these are really inky pens they're like weird i don't know how to explain it but we used to have these at our school in our primary school in blue but black ones these are so much better and you can buy these from school and they are 10 p per no, 5p per pen, which is a pretty good deal. And then these, well, these, I mean this, I got it from the co-op in a pack of two, I believe, for a pound. So, and it's black as well. So, got that. Then we have to use green pens at our school to correct things or mark things. So, I have two green pens. I have a Stadler, sticks, a Stadler stick pen in green. And... Yeah, pretty self-explanatory, just a green pen. Then I have this one, and it's not a branded pen. It was just like in a pack of like 50, and there was like black pens, blue, green, and red. So they come in a pack. So And we are allowed to write in blue pen, but I just don't like writing in blue pen. So then blue pens just went somewhere. I don't know where they are. Then I have this Bic Soft Feel Medium pen, and it's like... I don't know, it's got like a grippy, softy thing on it. Then my favourite pen in the whole world. This is like the best pen to write with. Like, if you're looking for a good pen that will last you a long time, this is the pen to go. It's these zebra, like just a zebra pen. And they are so soft, like, to write with. And they're so, like, easy. And if you don't believe me that I love them that much, I have every single pattern there ever was made. So I have the erasable kind which is the rubbers on the top, and they really do work. I tried them, like, they're good. Then I had the zebra kind of ones, and they're, like, an animal print. 
Then I have the marble ones, and these are so cute. They're like so pretty. And these were only a pound. Every single there was all of them come in a pack of two. So it was these two together, these two, and then these two. And they all the packs were a pound. So I was super happy when I found them. So yeah, and I have this pencil pot just in case. And my pens are falling through it, which is not very nice. Done it. There we go. Okay, then that is it for that pocket. That pocket is now empty. Then in the middle pocket, which is a zipper one, I have like just other pieces of stationery, like little bits. So I have a rubber just in case, like just in case. And then I have this mini sharpener. And this was, it came in a set, which is like a little box and it had, I believe a mini tape machine um scissors a hole punch a stapler and a stapler remover and then the extra um oh, what's it called mind blank extra it's like extra tape and extra um staples that's the word i'm looking for staples and then also this but i just took this out because i don't need that whole kit for now so yeah i have that then i have at our school we use whiteboards a lot at the moment like we have them everywhere so i had this mini whiteboard rubber and i just wrote my name on it because you know why not just jazz it up and i was bored at this point so i was just writing on everything then i have these sticky notes and when you open them i can't sh show you the front of them because they've got a name on it which you cannot see otherwise you're about to fire me but i have all these colours and when you open them they just look like this and these are like the weird tab ones so like they're easy for marking like marking your page in your book so like say if I wanted to mark something from this book or like I was learning about a chapter in this book I just stick a post-it note on there and then it's easy to find but there's all these colours so that was super handful handful helpful I mean and then we are also doing triangles and measuring like different stuff in maths at the moment so I have a protractor and normally I have a maths kit with like a compass a pencil and then all the different kind of rulers but at the moment I just have this because I cannot be bothered to carry other stuff in my bag and then in the last pocket I have a whiteboard pen this is by Beryl or Barrel I think it's called and that is just for writing on the whiteboards because if you, the pens that they supply you with don't work you end up having no pen and having to share so i just use mine then i have this mini bic pen and it's tiny and it's green and i like i don't love the color green but they didn't have any other colors with the like different color bottom so i just kept i just went with this one and it has like the fancy colors so it has a light pink, a purple, a green and a blue. So they're different colours because normally you only have like black, blue, green and red on the pen. So I just have that. Then I also, well last but not least in my pencil case I have these little panda highlighters and they're from Paper Chase. I believe they were on sale when I got them for like a pound or two pounds, something like that. And they have all different colours, they have orange, pink, yellow, blue, green. And they are so cute and they're like tiny like they're so cute they're just like, oh i just love them they're so cute and i haven't actually been able to try them out yet because i haven't been to school for like a week because i've been off sick because we have tonsillitis so my life was a hell at that point then add some like little more essentials because these actually don't fit in my little kit like well it would fit but it just takes up too much room so i have this like egg hair brush and it's in my favourite colour but one of my favourite colours it's in blue and it's so good it's like the bristles on it like the hair actual hair brush bit I don't know if you can see but they go really small and then big so it's easy to get the knots out your hair so I have that then I have as like an extra bit because I just love it I have this secret sass by Victoria secret summer rain rain kissed freezer and daisy which is a little spray and this was i believe 1.99 99 i don't know something like that and then 
why am I holding them both up? But I have that in my bag, and I already have like a perfume in there, but this was like a body mess, so I just keep it. I don't know why. And then I also have this deodorant, and this is by Tamiya. I don't know if you can see that. Tamiya. There we go. Try and get the light off it. And it's in this like really pretty bottle. And this was 49p, and it smells delicious. <sighs> if you, if there was smell of vision, you'd love this right now. But I have that. Then I also, well, last but not least in my bag, which is probably why my bag's really heavy because of all the stuff I'm looking at, I have my keys. And I have my house key and I also have my locker key. And I've decorated it with some stuff. So I have this little, like, leather plush heart. And it's got a little gold heart attached to it. And this is from my sister. She bought it for me for my birthday, I believe. And then I have this, like, I don't know how to explain it. It's like a bungee rope. And like it's easier to put it around your hand so you can just hold it. So I have that. Then I have my Zoella Whoa Inspire keyring, which is pink, well, it's kind of like a peachy kind of colour with gold and then it has a Z on it. There. And then I also have my ice cream. And this is my favourite pot little pom pom in the world. It was a pound and it was so cute I couldn't resist it. So it's a little mint ice cream and it's actually getting quite dirty so I might have to like wash it or something. Yeah, brilliant. So that's all that was in my very large and very heavy school bag and it's so light now I could pick it up with like one finger. I wouldn't be able to do that before. So thank you guys so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed. And if you want to see any other videos or requests click down below and I'll be sure to make them. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you subscribe and like the video, bye!